<laughs> okay. We did guess their age draft. What was it? A week? Maybe two weeks ago? Now today, we're going to be switching it to guess that player's weight. Here's how this draft's going to work. We're going to go through all 22 rounds. I'm going to try to guess the player that I once weight. If we get within 20 pounds, higher or lower, we get to pick them. If not, then guess what? We're picking the worst guy. I'm already preparing for the worst to happen. I am by no means an expert whenever it comes to doing stuff like this, but maybe you guys are. You guys could play along. Oh, geez. <laughs> Coach, forgot about this. We could do it too. Why not? Doug Marone just staying here looking like he ate three of me. Come on. This dude's huge. What's he weigh about? 270? <laughs> Holy crap, I'm actually right. He weighs 275 pounds. There's no... Okay, dude, dude, that's a big boy right there. Round one is going down. Quarterback round. Oh my... Okay. Uh, please, Tom, do not get this wrong. Uh, I, don't, I don't know. 197. 197. Let me do this research here. Michael Vick. 197. Come on, be within 20 pounds. I forgot to search weight. Weight. There we go. Hold on. No, wait. What did I say? 197. He's 216. That is 19 pounds away. Boom, baby. We're getting Michael Vick for round one. No matter what happens anymore. Oh my. Okay. This is just, this draft might go down in history as one of the greatest ever. If we can land Jadeveon Clowney here. Jadeveon Clowney, 253. He's going to be coming in. I forgot to search weight again. Not awkward at all. He is coming in at 267. We are getting Jadeveon Clowney as well. All right. Hopefully this threshold of 20 pounds isn't going to be too easy. Um, The next guy we're going to go for, Matt Milano. He's a linebacker. I'm going to say 233. Moment of truth, 221. We will be getting him as well. Yo, what's up? All right, we are four for four up to this point, including the coach round. We have Earl Thomas and Jamal Adams both up. I want Jamal Adams. You see the hit power. It's there. It's lethal. It's deadly. It's all of the above. Jamal Adams, no doubt. 214. What did I just say? He weighs 214 pounds. Did I guess that perfectly? Nonetheless, I was within a pound or two. That's incredible. I'm fantastic at this. Sign me up right now at the carnival. Actually, no, don't do that. That'd be a terrible job. T.Y. Hilton. Oh boy, this dude's tiny. I'm going to say 178 and he's coming in at 183. I'm unstoppable up to this point. Five for five going into round six. We could have a pretty tough one here. Leonard Williams. I feel confident with 257. 257. He is 291. Whoa. Okay, that's a big boy right there. So now we are stuck with the right guard here. I probably should have done 10 pounds. Um... Should I switch to that right now? Yes, that just happened. I didn't expect to be this good at this. I'm sorry. To be fair, I'm going to get smacked in the game, so at least something's going to go right today. Javon Kinlaw, defensive tackle. They're pretty big. Uh, 277. The answer will be 311. Whoa. Not good. Not good at all. 80. <laughs> no. You see what we're left with here? That's not good. You got a problem? Oh, this is a massive round. Richard Sherman's here. Really could use a cornerback. Like, extra bad. Richard Sherman is going to be 215 pounds on the nose. Please be close to that. He's 194. Mm, I messed that one up. I messed that up so bad. I'm going to go with the Cuda because I think I have a better chance of guessing his weight. I'm going to say 184 pounds. He weighs... 205. <laughs> We're, this is going to be our number one cornerback, guys. This is not a good situation. You got a problem? 177 pounds for Henry Ruggs. He weighs 187. We got away by exactly 10 pounds. Thank goodness, because we needed another wide receiver. Come on, guys. Brian Burns definitely weighs 234. No, he doesn't. He weighs 249. We get Ty Law, but that's not the end of the world. I'm going to say 201 pounds for Jim Brown. Jim, please come up big. 231. <laughs> All right, so we're officially stuck with 87 Marlon Mack as our running back. And then the final round here. I'm going to guess he's approximately 240. Hey, look at that. He's 245. So we get a middle linebacker. So here's where we're at. 90 overall team, 89 defense, 92 offense. At least that's what they're telling me. We got game one about to come up. Wish me a little bit of luck. Go down to the comments. You know, drop a like for your boy. And here we go. Hold up. Hold up. Time out. Time out. Look. Look. Hear me out. I feel like it has to be known how much fun I've been having jamming out to my Raycon E25 earbuds. I'm not kidding. <laughs> You guys got to hear me out. I've been using these E25s for the past month or two and can confirm that these are the best earbuds on the market. Here's the thing too. They're about half the price of any other premium wireless earbud on the market. I don't know how they do it for this price. 
But I'm not gonna ask any questions. And then they got people like Snoop Dogg and Cardi B and our boy J.R. Smith that back these earbuds up 100%. Hear me out. I've been using these every single day, whether it be listening to music, editing YouTube videos, cutting the grass, working out. Okay, maybe not working out yet at least. Their everyday E25 earbuds are their best model yet, with six hours of playtime, seamless Bluetooth pairing, more bass, and a more compact design that gives you a nice noise-isolating fit. It also comes in fun new colors. If you check out the link at the top of this video's description, they're going to throw in an extra 15% off on top of your entire order, and they already have some incredible prices on there. One more huge thank you to Raycon and to everybody who's able to support me through them. With that said, it's time to get back into this video. Don't forget to check out by Raycon Con.com forward slash pizza to get a pair for yourself. Look at the top three. If you just take a gator at them, guys, that looks like it could be one of the greatest teams I've ever drafted, at least in Madden 20. This is going to be very tricky for me. I'm not used to having... Oh, wait, maybe I am. I was going to say, not used to the 4-3 defense, so you're going to have to bear with me as always. I didn't think I was going to guess Doug Moran as the coach, okay? Hey, by the way, he has Jim Brown. We could have had him on our team. What was that? What is happening? Here we go yet again. It's fourth down. He will be going for this, and I'm right there with KJ Wright. Really wanted to take that to the house for the crib call. I will be going for this anyways. I just pressed the right button. I, <laughs> I tried to throw it the rugs there. Not even gonna lie. I don't know how that worked out. I'm gonna get this one off quickly to Andre Reed on the slant. I see man coverage. I got that all day. I switch up these zones on the outside. Hopefully, it pays off for us. He's running around and somehow he hasn't went down until he picked up the first. I just don't understand. There's going to be a quarterback spy out now for the rest of this. Right to me, Willie. Hey, Willie, you're running the wrong way. <laughs> and that, my friends, is opponent number one. He is gone. We are now in our second game. There's going to be two 99 quarterbacks going up against each other. Heck out of here. We have two people there. He has Cam Newton, though. We obviously have the Michael Vick, so it should be a pretty fun matchup. <laughs> Playing good defense, though. I'm going to go for something a little bit ridiculous. Don't know if it's going to work. It did not. This is bad. This is very bad. Why do I feel like I'm going to be seeing a whole lot from this formation. Oh, wow, what a pass. And it's a run, straight up the middle. Ingram, bring him down. Now time for one more big play. And we got an interception, Matt Milano. Come on, get you at your boy. Oh, what a play, he had a good drive going. We just stuffed him there. He's on the safety over on the right, well, which means good. I should be able to roll out a little bit. Step up, Vic, yeah, we got sacked. This is stupid, this is dumb. What? A, why is this running through my head? This is a good idea. <laughs> it's not though. Please, whatever you do, do not ask any questions. Let me just send this and do this my way with Vic up the middle. Get down on fourth down on my own 15. Okay, the tight end's open. That's really dumb. Really dumb. I don't think that should have been picked, but not a good decision by me. He did the same thing with this play. Oh, there's the quarterback in Tain out of field goal range now. Not sure what's running through his head right now, uh, but there You're not it is. Going anywhere. Thanks for batting it, because I actually didn't want the pick there. I'm sorry, guys. This really just isn't good at all. Why? Henry Ruggs. T.Y. Hilton. Intercepted. Safety. Nothing. None of them went my way. Let's just keep embarrassing myself this game. Why not? All right. What a half. <laughs> Nobody scored. Oh, what a mess. See if we could just hit an out route here to get anything going. That would be nice. Whoa. Oh! I have a chance to roll out to the left with Vic, and I'm taking off, baby. Get me in the open field. -y. I can't talk. Could be looking for another big one here. I don't know. I don't know, fellas. I got him. B. I got him. Andre. Feed nope. in. Feed in. That's not a touchdown. What do you want me to do, guys? Hey, I guess at this point, whatever's working, right? And this died. <laughs> <laughs> My offense is just so gas at this point. I do not want to take a hit stick. Go Get back. off me. Good run. Oh, we broke a tackle and scored. That's the last time I ever hit on the 87 Marlon Mack. Phenomenal. And this is actual. We'll just throw this time. Kind of weird. Be honest here. Abke just got Moss, of course. By the way, I don't even know if I'm saying that guy's name right. This is going to be the deep slants play. Or just a regular slant play. Oh, got it clamped. No, I didn't. Hit stick. Little hint to this guy. I am not too sure on how to stop that play. Like, 
He had a guy wide open. I kid you not. I think everybody's seen it besides this guy. Would have absolutely been a touchdown. We can bury him here. All we need is a big score. I'm running again. Vic will be taking off. No fumbling. Come on, Devlin. Pick somebody up for me here. I don't really know what that was. I should have B here. Possession catch. Nice, Ruggs. This guy's so mad. That was the rage quit. That's the one that did it all. And we're going to do this today with 57 passing yards for Michael Vick. I think all of that came off of one pass play. <laughs> oh, maybe he's challenging it. Nothing. Oh, buddy messed up with the user. That'll be Andre Reed. R.I.P. Oh, boy. Okay, that was pretty good. That You know what? At least we got the offense rolling that second half there. This is going to be the guess the player's weight draft. If you guys want to see me try to guess something else, whether it be a player's height, the player's college, I don't know. I'm sure you guys can think of something else. If you do and I see your comment, I'll make sure to shout it out too, by the way. Go ahead and put a comment down below. If you enjoy these type of videos, drop a like. It takes a second out of your day. It really does mean a lot to me. Uh, more drafts and stuff going to be coming soon, so make sure you're subscribed for it. With that said, you already know. You're the best. God bless. Don't forget to keep it first. I'll see you guys on the next one. Peace out, fellas.